All right. Devolver bootleg is now over. Now it's time for... What are we doing? Oh, right. More trash. Great. Title T. So I'm calling this trash flash stash because... I don't, I don't need to justify myself. Here, let me do um, an intro. Okay, this is a uh, flash game. <laughs> These are flash games from the mid 2000s. Um, some of them are good. Some of them are from Newgrounds. And some of them are just like shitty licensed ones. Nary helped put this together with the help of some other folks. And um, I guess we'll start with. Oh no, what is this one? What? The fuck? to make the game lower just a little bit. The golden age. When people tell me to play flash games, this is what they want me to play. Oh god! And I have the volume down really- Wow. Yep, this is that golden age that everyone keeps telling me about. Vinny, you got to play Flash games. From the mid-2000s. So now you know um, what you're in for, I think. Final Fantasy Sonic X6. Right click during battle for options. Hello, feller, feller brawlers. Yeah, I'm Play the intro. Final Fantasy Sonic. Why? Even if it makes petals bloom bit by bit. Like a rose. Shakes my heart. Love is scary. I seem to break. I seem to break. I seem to break. I seem to break. So Sorry, I'm volume issues with these flash games for some reason. I didn't realize I was at maximum volume because I was hearing them at twenty percent of what you were hearing them at. fixed now um if it's a certain love i seek all right i'm ready let's get started okay okay w but why is like zero here for wh like wh wh why does sonic have the buster sword what is happening I think part of me wants to leave up where it says file and help because it adds to the, uh, it adds to the charm, but I'll just get rid of them. I wonder if this is a VOD mute. Now back to where we left off. Here I come! Huh. Impossible! What? Tails! Knuckles! <laughs> Are you guys alright? <laughs> At this rate, they won't make it. Blue Hedgehog, I am impressed. You've made it past the guard. Now hand over that sword and stone. This doesn't look good, Sonic. The oh no. Too serious. Was that Knuckle? Oh, it's Shadow. Never mind. Shadow, 
please get them out of here. What about those? Donkey Kong two? Country music? I'll handle them. Handle us? I admire your persistence, Hedgehog. But you're mistaken if you think you can beat us. What? I know I can beat you. Yeah. Some of this voice voice acting is actually not as bad as you'd expect. It's pretty Let decent. Go. You're finished. And the microphones aren't right, that bad Hedgehog. either. I'm through playing games. All right. All now right. Let's get this show on the road. Engage battle. You're finished. <laughs> let's go. It's got a fully functional combat system. Boy, am I just counting down the minutes until 3:30. I can't believe how much effort was put into this. <laughs> cost 100... Uh, whoa, whoa. This cost HP? That's fine. Wait, maybe that's not fine. Ready when you are. I think I'm gonna lose my first fight. Maybe I'm supposed to. I think this is a scripted. This is a script. <laughs> what? Sorry, this is a scripted loss. I think I had a stroke for my second time tonight. I had a stroke. I'm not feeling so hot. Vinny, it's not scripted. Oh, okay. Nah, it is. I'm pretty sure it is. I can't do it. Now I'll show you. Come on, step it up. <laughs> Too slow. You're finished. <laughs> Well, we're gonna see the end screen in a moment, so... It'll be scripted by the time we get to the game over. Remember, if you see a game over, it was supposed to happen that way. It's to advance the plot. Wow, I can't believe Sonic is dead. Alright, that was Final Fantasy Sonic X6. Sonic, Mega Man, and Final Fantasy all in one. I can't believe I just played that. This one's called Portal. Based on a Valve software game. Portal. Flash version. This is as close as we'll get to a new Valve game, so. I'm wondering if I remember playing any of these. These are all licensed games, or 100% real licensed games, that's the name of this folder, so. For a little while, expect that. Oh, I have played this. I remember this being, like, again, surprisingly quality. Just a second. I guess Shell doesn't have her, um... ...her legs thing yet.
Is it? It's not pronounced Chell, is it? This is Wall Dude. It is. Oh my God, my world just got rocked. Half the chat is saying yes. Half the chat is saying no. I don't know. This game isn't even canon. What do you mean? No, dude, I'm I'm pretty sure this is as canon as they as they get. It's canicular. GLaDOS pronounces it as Chell in an unused voice line. Well, that's not canon either. Also, that <laughs> they're using the screenshot sound from Steam, and it's confusing me greatly. But yeah, I do remember playing this. Um, it's good. This feels like 2D Portal, very much so. God damn it. It's amazing some of the stuff you could do in Flash. What just happened? What? Alright, we'll stop there. Super Mario 63. <laughs> this one's got a very small resolution, so don't expect too much. Have I played this? I've played a Mario 63. I, I might have played this exact one. This one's also good. Yeah, no, these, the, the licensed games, some of these are good. We didn't get to the trash yet, necessarily. Vinny, why are you playing games I played during my school computer lab periods? That's what I'm here for. Yeah, I think I played this. I don't think I played it back in the day. I'm pretty sure I played this, like, on stream fairly recently. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, I, I want to say, though, like, I played a lot of these Flash games just because they were free, and yes, you could play them during Computer Lab. This was before Steam, so you would just kind of play whatever the fuck someone made in Flash. And, and you know, sometimes it was good, sometimes it was stick figures fighting, and sometimes even the stick figures fighting were good. Do you remember Xiao Mao? Was that how you say it? It was just stick figure fighting? Xiao Xiao? Am I saying that right? I probably am not. It's, it's Shell. It's Shell. It's... So there's a triple jump. No, I don't think I played this on stream. I think I played another Mario 63. I'm pretty sure there's just a lot of Mario 63s. Oh wow, Flood. This probably came out when Flood was brand new. Like, so, uh, Super Mario Sunshine was brand new. I remember thinking, boy, I guess Mario has Flood now for every game from this point forward. That was a lie. Yeah. Yeah. 
no, actually. So wait, Mario Sunshine came out 2003. Right? Or was that 2002? 2002 it came out, okay. Wind Waker came out 2003. And this was 2009? Oh wow, okay, this is like... This is not like the beginning of Newgrounds, this is sometime after. This makes me want to just go back and play Mario Maker more. No. Uh, we'll get up there. So remember, I'm using the arrow keys to move around, and I'm pressing up arrow to jump. So... Minus and plus. Oh, wow. Look at that. This is quality. Like it says in the bottom left, this is actual quality. This is the best Mario 63 I've played, I think. <laughs> I've played pieces of Mario 63s in my day. And that's probably not any even that much of an exaggeration. Okay, it takes some stuff from Galaxy as well. Holy shit, dude. Holy fuck. It actually kind of plays like Mario 64. <laughs> you have to, like, do the exact same stuff to fly. Yeah, this is definitely like, um, you can tell someone who really loves Mario games made this. Like, this isn't just, you know, one game. It's not like many of the shitty Marios, like the super crusty opaque Marios, where it's just whatever. Like, they actually paid really close attention to getting Mario's movement feeling right. I don't particularly love playing this with the arrow keys, but... This is fantastic. And if I had this in Computer Lab, I would have played it. Ultimate Flash Sonic. So this is the last of the 100% real licensed game category. Vinny, do you remember Madness Combat? I do. Cream? Oh. That's a real character? Cream is very real? Oh. This looks and plays like a Sonic game, and it's, again, quality. I'm, I'm playing with the arrow keys, but for arrow key controls, it feels pretty good. This is not your shitty Sonic game showcase game. This actually feels like Sonic and Spider-Man, but it mostly... Y you can't really even tell this is Flash. I mean, a little bit. You can kind of see it, like, there's the jerkiness of the movement. 
There's like a very distinctly flash feel to it, but... It definitely works, and if you're in computer lab in 2004 or 5 and you have nothing else to do, this, this is definitely a good game to play, along with that Mario game. What I would not recommend, however, are probably most of the Wii games I streamed about an hour ago. Okay. This is the most Flash thing I've ever seen. <laughs> so you got X-Files, Aliens, and Dress Up. Okay, so for those of you who were a little younger, who weren't around in the golden age of Flash games, this may seem a little strange, but I'm going to do my best to explain it. Um, there were a lot of dress-up games where you would just drag outfits over to an anime character, a Mario, a Luigi, uh, an alien, apparently. This is just a thing. Frozen Elsa. I mean, they're still happening, but they were just especially big at that time. Vinny, we've all seen Rev's streams. I would hope so. I am having fun. Cool maze game. Now this, this folder is called Only in Flash, so these are probably as Flash as you'll get. The maze. Test your skill. Oh god, I know what this is. Alright, chat. I'm gonna warn you now. This is most likely a screamer. I'm putting the volume all the way down. Okay. So what I mean by that is there is a very, very good chance that there will be a grotesque image that pops up in a moment. These were, these were all the rage. And, uh, it's probably here. Okay, so here it comes, chat. Close your eyes if you can't... If you can't... What is level, level 3 fucking... is awful. Oh, it's me. <laughs> you could just barely hear it, but yeah, that was one of my screams. Okay, great. <laughs> cool maze game. Thanks, Jeremy. Don't shoot the puppy. Start. Okay. I don't like that one. I don't like that one. I didn't press anything. It just happened. Fuck that game. Push the big red button to continue. Okay. Push the rectangle to continue. This is called idiot test. Push the red button twice, then the green button once. Blue button three times. You pass the first level, you are now considered a borderline idiot. Press a, the picture of the cat. You would just, you would just spend hours doing idiot tests. I've done several of these. I'm very bad at this video game. Press the yellow button once, blue button, and yellow. R. You fool. I'm an idiot. 
Rock, paper, scissors with Richard Simmons. <laughs> this music is so blown out. Yeah, it's Pokemon. Does anyone not know who Richard Simmons is? Just curious. Okay. Well, yeah, he's he's alive. I think he's in like hiding. He's become a bit of a recluse lately, so he's not like leaving his house. So I don't know, man. I hope he's all right. New grounds crusty trash pack remnants. So there was a crusty trash pack that I got, and here are some games from that crusty trash pack. Um, choose one, Alka-Seltzer. <laughs> we are having fun, yes? <laughs> um, hot sauce. What a strange time for media. Remember, there were there was no YouTube. So you got most of your entertainment from Flash videos. Do you remember the Frog Blender game? I do. There was another thing. It was Joe Cartoons had something where you had to, like, microwave a hamster. There's a lot of, like, cartoon violence towards hamsters back in the day. Those poor bastards. Wow. It, again, if you weren't around on the internet in its very beginning, I don't know how much you really missed out. Maybe a little bit. I'm not as nostalgic about it as some people are. You know, I liked I liked it. I grew up during that time. It was fine, but uh, I like I like YouTube. I like internet. Um, I like being able to load a movie instantly. So. Pros and cons. You know what I mean? There, there were pros, there were cons. Wow. I have nothing left for you. I have no food. That's all. <laughs> uh, the Jar Jar Killer. <laughs> yep, here we go. This is when Jar Jar was still brand new and no one liked Jar Jar. And so there were lots of ways to commit violence <laughs> against Jar Jar. Wow. Look at the quality. <laughs> so, so quality. Wow. Including gradient buttons. I haven't seen those in a while. <laughs> the, blood. the blood. Look at the blood. Oh, it's awful.
Jesus, fuck, it was a violent time. Meanwhile, at the Pentagon... You killed Jar Jar Binks. Good work. Now no one will ever have to see or hear, incorrectly spelled here, that annoying character, character ever again. Huh. Luigi's Confession, part four. So we're just getting part four of Luigi's Confession. I don't even, I don't even know what the first couple parts are like. Okay, so we got the Godfather font and even the logo. It's a little bit, you know, infringement. It's a little cheap, but that's fine. Where is Mario? I was supposed to meet him here. Your mission is to help me find Mario. He told me to meet him under the tree at 7 o'clock. He wasn't here. He's never late. Please help me. You are my only hope. <laughs> toad number one, do you know where Mario is? Earlier I saw Koopa go up the toad trail to the castle at the top of the mountain. That's about all I saw. Ask around. Art style is just phenomenal. Toad 3 says, I'm so stoned. Toad Guru, the well is actually a secret entrance to the Koopa Castle. You can try to find your brother, but you'll have to go through the sewer maze. Oh man. Go now, good luck. This is riveting. This is the passage to get up into the castle. To get in the castle, you will be challenged with three tests in the secret passage. They are all challenging! <laughs> uh, I go to, which, wait, which pipe is different? Um, two? <laughs> look at Luigi's! Look at Luigi's, just a couple circles stacked on top of each other. Catch the shy guy in five sec. Three, two, one, go. I don't know what you mean, catch the shit. What, what does that mean? Oh, Come on. I have to click the shit, but, but the shit got... I just clicked outside of the game. Oh, oh my god. It... Well, I got him. The last of the secret underground passage uh, rounds you have you finish. You have you finish the maze within 15 seconds. Um. Uh. What? What? Oh. Oh, I'm controlling Louis. Oh, okay. I have to use the arrow keys. Small, small Ouija. It's real easy to get stuck on these pipes, too. Like, real, real easy. It's frustrating. Good choice. <laughs> the, 
this Luigi is second only to the Luigi from Mario Teaches Typing. Good music choice. Not Mario, but I'll accept. Luigi! Yes, that's right. I've come to save my brother. Watch out behind you! Not my, well, fucking Luigi from Mario Teaches Typing. We're fucking screwed, Luigi just said. The end. Oh. Replay? Did I- wait, wait, what? Oh, okay. Never mind. Um, I meant Luigi from Mario is Missing. Right? That's the one I mean. Or which one do I mean? Which which is the Luigi that's like kind of weird looking? Ouija. Yeah, that's Ouija. From um Mario's Missing. DOS version. The PC version. Thank you. Okay, so that was Luigi's Confession Part 4. We may never get a sequel to that. I've been waiting for the sequel for about 17 years now, and sadly, I don't have a sequel. But I do have something called Kick People in the Balls. Your mission is to kick as many people in the balls as possible. Everyone will come from all angles, so be on your feet. Don't miss any, because you will be a loser. Again, this is so of its time. This is so fucking early 2000. It's it's just perfectly preserved, like a time capsule. <laughs> there's no score. There's no score system. There's no penalties. There's no consequences. You just keep kicking people in the balls. You kicked one people in the nuts?! One people? Chat, back me up here. You saw me kick more than one people in the nuts. Hunting with Peter. Oh, Jesus fuck. I was, <laughs> I was hoping it wouldn't be that Peter. But it is that Peter. Brought to you by Planet Family Guy. You've been invited to go along with Peter and Chris and their latest attempt at bonding, James Bond. Okay. That's the thing about hunting, you gotta be patient. There he is. Ah, uh, yeah. There he is. The hell was that? The hell was that? Uh. Um. Wow. There he is. Look. Yeah. Just... Look! The further there we get is. away from this Look. time period, the weirder the shit's there? gonna be. Like, it's already weird. It's already, like, how the fuck? But give it another ten years, and this is just gonna be, like... It's gonna be... Alien. I mean, is, is Family Guy even going to be on the air in 10 years? There he is. This is fun, Dad. You know what? Uh, yes, yeah. it will. There he is. Yes, it will. Oh, uh, yeah. Who's the big man now, eh? Eh? Oh, great. Fuck. Uh, yeah. Vinny, when will you apologize for this existing? Yeah. Oh, so this is my fault now. Yeah. There he is. Of course, Chris will have more of a tendency to want to play squirrel in front of us. Watch out for him. Oh, so now I have to see. Now we've got more challenge. Chris shows up, and I have to avoid shooting Chris. See, there's real gameplay here. You shot Chris, what the hell is wrong with you? Here's to hoping he pulls through. I don't know, I kind of shot him in the face.
escape from work. Look at his face. Oh shit, gotta go to work. Go home. Yep. I, I love the way Flash... Like the motion. On your way home, a plane hit you. Like the character just gets smaller. It's it's really uh it's really quite amazing. This food sucks, give me a refund. I actually made I used Flash for several years. I made plenty of Flash animations that are now sadly gone. But yeah, I remember doing motion tweening and drawing in Flash. I did it for a while. This food sucks, give me a refund, throw knife at him. Oh, he's still going. You stabbed a customer, you are fired. You threw a knife at someone, so you were fired and will spend 10 to 15 years in jail. Vinny, Luigi's Confession has a sequel on Newgrounds, and it's the end of the story. Oh, that's awesome. You should you should go check that out yourself. That refund comes at oh wait, what? Hello? Beavis? Bothead? What? Did you skip school? No, Dad. Oh, okay, bye then. I can take it from here. Go to grill. Touch it again. Oh. Okay. You touched the grill again and died. Wow. Dreeb. No, no, no refund for you. You son of a bitch. Okay. Fries, you idiot. You want fries, you idiot. Yes, I skipped school. I will kill you. <laughs> oh, that is funny. I didn't skip school. Hey, where is my fucking hamburger? I do not have it, asshole. Hey, where is my fucking hamburger? Uh, can I get a ride? Okay. Oh. Um, oh, okay, I'll get in. Where are we going, Treebeard? To the mountains. Keep riding. <laughs> Why am I laughing at this? Oh no! Oh my god! This is so fucking terrible! <laughs> oh my god! I'll try one more thing, I, I guess. I don't know why I'm still playing this. Hello? Now, the music loop is not as bad as the monkey games from earlier, at least. Thank God for that. It's still pretty bad, but the monkey games had it... It was way worse. Call over the manager. Manager guy, come here. What the fuck do you want? Touch the grill. Sure, why not? Take his keys and leave. You did not kill him, so he is chasing after you. You shoot him. <laughs> oh. You won. That's the- that is the victory condition! That was the victory condition. Okay, then.
deep sleep. I'm, I am. I don't know if I played stuff like that and laughed at it. I just, I, I, I might have. You know, when when you're like 13, well, how old was I? No, I was like 16 when this shit, like 2000, 2001, I was 16. Armor games. Wow, I haven't seen this in a while. Vinny, this isn't trash. Okay. This fucking Nietzsche quote is in at least 60% of the horror games or scary games that exist on this planet. It's a contractually obligated thing that you have to do if you're making a horror game. You gotta have that quote. Or you have to put HP Pocraft in there as well. Vinny, you played this? I think I did. Yeah, I, I played this. I remember this. I don't know how long ago I played it, but... Okay. Yeah, I didn't just play it, I streamed it. Four or five years ago? Jim, wake up. Yeah, this one you might want to check out. Maybe you can find it on a previous stream of mine. I don't know where you would. It's called Deep Sleep. Pretty good. Um, so Nari included uh, an image with this next game. It says, Nari's warning, check this first. Bro, this game is cring. If you play it, you're going to lose subscribers. It's called... Um... Oh... How do I unsubscribe from myself? That wacky Sonic. Good thing Rainbow Dash is here to save him. Again, you can see the effort. This isn't Doko to work. Vinny, you posted cringe, bro. Vinny, you posted cringe, bro. Bruh. It's basically that first Sonic game I played earlier. But with my little pony in it. 
as well. This is the real Shadow the Hedgehog. This battle seems like it would take a very, very, very long time. Okay. Note from the original pack creator, it says in the text. It says, watch the intro. I did. Okay, I did. Um, well, that was, uh, that was something else. Now, the Flash collection is not over. It's, it's really not. But what I do have now are actual good games. Like, Interactive Buddy. I, I mean, I think these are good games. I might have played several ones of these. I think I'm almost possibly... I almost certainly have played this, is what I meant to say. Late. It's, it's laid out. You know what I mean? Exactly. It's laid out. Yep, played this. So yeah, you just like kind of do bad things to your buddy. I think. Find new skins. <laughs> oh my god, strawberry clock. These were is that Tom Fulp, Napoleon Dynamite. Oh my god. Years ago, all over again, for fuck's sake. This makes me feel old. I guess you just earn money the more stuff you do. The, the more abuse. Good. It's even the purple one, too. I, all these years later. Who would have known? I would eventually have the purple tubby emote. Mate, this is fucked up. I don't think I've ever felt older. Like, I don't think I've ever felt like the, the fucking distinct passage of time because I mostly am, I'm fine with it. But today has brought... This is, like, actually weird. I'm experiencing some fucking weird stuff right now. Fucking Teletubbies. But, yep. That's what you do. You just beat the shit out of this poor bastard. And then you can uh, continue buying stuff, right? Yep, here we go. Medieval flail, pistol, infants. Okay, what? Are you a member of DeviantArt.com? Well, are you, chat? I earn almost no money from, from this. Big boom. 
Big bada boom. NES style movement. Blood and gore. Wow. This is a lot of stuff. No. It's actually, again, for a stupid concept, it's actually really kinda high quality. Oh, it just cuts the frame rates down. For the yeah, the smoothness. So, blood and gore in Flash just meant red circles. It was a violent time. It was a very, very violent time. This poor Teletubby did nothing to deserve this. Well... Yeah, yeah. Kind of. Infants. Those are some crusty looking babies. You could also be nice to your buddy. Wait, really? How, how do you be nice to your buddy? Oh, I see. You have to just do cool stuff. You can play catch with your buddy. I'm surprised there are people that are able to tell me about this. There we go. Yep. You equally get money for being nice. But then again, you could also explode at mouse. Don't mind me, just saving up for the most expensive item in the game. Don't even know what this does, and I'm still playing this. Okay. Well, he likes that. say that but this is just genuinely baffling how I ended up getting stuck playing the buddy game yet again nearly 20 years later bowling balls and strong gravity vortex was a lot of fun okay I gotta buy bowling balls that will be how we Let's just try that, and then I'll move on. <laughs> I gotta see what it looks like. Bowling balls. Okay, here we go. This is it. Okay. funny because we're going to look at Thanos culture the same way we look at this. You know, given like 19 years, 20 years, we're going to look back at the Thanos Fortnite thing and it's going to be the same way we look at these Flash games. I've created a blood bagel.
kitten cannon. Like that. Yep. This was a very, very popular band and popular song at this time. Exceedingly so. Okay, this game was repeated a million times. But again, look at this gratuitous violence towards innocent creatures. Like, I'm sorry this is happening. I feel bad about this. <laughs> so many fucking... So many poor things. So many poor innocent creatures that would just get hurt in the early to mid-2000s. Bloons? I may be allergic to cats, but, you know, I like them. I've played bloons. In fact, I did bloons recently on, um... The, um, Nintendo Wii shop stuff. But Bloons was good shit, and Bloons was actually, um... Able to, like, kind of stand the test of time. Oh, it's the same... it's the same levels. Vinny was this Hoobastank. I think Hoobastank was popular around this time. I mean, I applaud anyone that would name their band something with the word stank in it. But some of these games are, are so, like, timeless that it's hard to stop playing them. Like this, this is just a good game. You missed. Try another. Boy, I'm bad at this. Hell yeah, bloons. Bloons it up. Fuck yeah. Yo, bloons is hard to put down. Bloons is good. Bowman, too. Let's check out a couple more. I got a couple more classics, as they're called, in this folder. I remember this one, too. Good. This guy's a fucking trooper. Still, still, still doing it. Even after two horrific accidents. That's fine. We'll just keep going. We're just remember, you almost couldn't have a flash game without some form of blood in it. That was like a golden rule. Almost. Okay, here's one people I are definitely going to know. Crush the castle.
And this is bringing me back. So now this was Angry Birds first, yes? What am I- what am I doing wrong? Oh, I see. You just have to choose one to... ...let go of- I see, okay. In an alternate reality... ...Crush the Castle was bigger than Angry Birds. Problem is, this is a little more complex than Angry Birds, and so, once Angry Birds came along and simplified it, that became, apparently, it, it took off. But, you know, this is the one I played. Yep, there's a world map and everything. more complex, not really. Uh, only slightly. I think the, the reason Angry Birds also probably took off was the, just the bright, cheery, very easily identifiable, like, from a distance from their silhouettes, characters. Like, very, very, very distinct and appealing characters for kids, which are Angry Birds. Marketable. Thank, thank you. I don't know why. My, my, my 3.30 a.m. brain yacht could not think of that word, but... Very, very marketable compared to this. Oh, fuck! And again, you'll notice the blood. There has to be gore and blood in these Flash games. There just, there just has to. I guess. There's no blood and gore. How are you going to prove to your friends that you're cool? I'm hardcore, dude. Bro, I want to tell you about. <laughs> I hate my own little kid voice that I do so much. I can I can really aggravate myself with that voice. One more, one more, one more. Let's get it. Let's get it. Don't stop. Get it. Get it. Watch the way I cheddar head it. Very good. Um, Line Rider classic. Line Rider, I think a lot of people have seen. Line Rider has, has maintained some semblance of popularity, right? So this isn't as much of a relic, but Line Rider was great, and you can see some amazing creations that people have made with it. But this is, I think, the original. This is such a cool concept.
There's no blood. Oh, you're right. <laughs> what the fuck am I doing? I I might have accidentally drawn balls. Was not intentional. Okay, mother load. There's pandemic two. There's a couple more. Just a couple more. Mother load. Oh, I think I remember this. What? No, I don't want to log in. I don't have an account. What do you mean? Does the site even exist anymore? Okay, this one doesn't work. <laughs> this one no longer works. Or maybe I'm just dumb. Maybe I gotta log in. Pandemic 2, I think this is the one right with the, um... With the things, the diseases. Madagascar, right? The Madagascar meme came from this. Shut it down. Okay. So I don't- I don't want to do that. It's getting real late. I want- I'd like to just go through this. I only got two left. The stream started with monkeys and it ends with monkeys. Holy shit, you're right. So this is called Tactical Assassin. Oh, that was a civilian. You gotta read the briefing. Just, um, eliminate head arms dealer. Be reading over his presentation. His bodyguard will be close. have been raised. I don't recall having played this one. Man, maybe they should give me a silencer for the sniper rifle. You're supposed to wait. Um, what, is this music from Metal Gear Solid? It is. MGS3? Okay. I figured it was. I've only played that one one time. I see. I, I don't know what I was thinking before. I, I misread the stuff. But this is pretty cool in its own weird way. Target is arriving by limousine. He'll be walking, so aim carefully. Do not let him enter the meeting. Uh, Alright, we'll do this one last one. Final jump. Oh! Jeez. Yeah, this one kind of still holds up. And finally, the world's hardest game.
No, I I don't recall having played this one. I don't think I did. It's only, it's only game. Why you have to be made? The world's hardest game. Okay. So, maybe not all trash. Maybe this is just, um... Flash... Flash... Stash... Flash... Stash... I can speak. Yeah, some good ones in there. Some classics. Um, some real bad... 100% real licensed games. And some good crusty trash, but... It's good to go back to that time. Maybe we can do a part two at some point. I'm sure there's plenty. There, there could be a part three or a four or a part 13 with the amount of Flash games that exist in this world. But I think I would probably do like one or two more parts of it if I found some good ones. So um, I'm open to getting more to Nari if anyone wants to help make compilations. I always listen when it comes to Sunday streams, I do accept compilations. Um, but they're heavily vetted. Now they have to be, um, someone recently just sent a folder of porn and while it may seem hilarious on the outset, I think I'm going to have to pass on the porn. Thank you though. That was very nice of you. Um, but yeah, I mean, I'm always open to different ideas that you may have. We just got an itch.io pack. There's a lot of weird fucking games that I haven't played yet. Uh, corruptions are always accepted as well. And, uh, you know, shovelware, stuff like that. So, that's it. Let Vinny, can you forward that to me? Mm, no. So that's it. Thanks for watching. Um, we're going to do the art. And uh, tomorrow, probably do some Crash Team Racing. Um, another My Friend Pedro stream. More Mario Maker this week. Bloodstained. And Dreams. Maybe Smash Brothers. I don't know. There's a lot of stuff I want to do and get to. So a lot of games this week. And soon enough, I'll be finishing up some stuff, and I will also be streaming Final Fantasy IX. Not this coming week, for sure not this coming week, but in the next two weeks. I just want to play through the stuff I have, and not bite off more than I can chew. But I am looking forward to the Final Fantasy IX stream, and it's going to look good, too. Because I have all the, the files, and it's modded, and it's going to be great. What about Half-Life 2 Episode 2? That's a shorter game, so I can do that eventually, but maybe give me another week or two. Maybe I can do that concurrently with Final Fantasy IX. Could be cool.